Imagine soaring above the clouds, cruising at an altitude where the air is thin and the challenges are many. There's a whole world of complexities that come into play when aircraft take to these high altitude skies. Today, we're going to delve into those challenges, shedding light on the unique difficulties of high altitude and long range flight. This understanding is not just about fascination, but it's crucial for aviation safety and performance. From the impact of thin air on engine performance to the physiological effects on pilots and passengers, from navigating complex weather patterns to managing fuel for long-haul flights, each aspect presents its own set of challenges. In addition, we'll also discover how aircraft are purpose-built to withstand these conditions and what technological innovations are helping us overcome these hurdles. So strap in and buckle up as we venture into the thin air and explore what it takes to conquer the skies. As we ascend, the air gets thinner, but what does this mean for an aircraft in flight? Let's delve a bit deeper into this. You see, air density drops as we climb higher into the atmosphere. Now this has a two-pronged effect on the aircraft. Firstly, the engines. They rely on a mix of fuel and air to generate thrust. But with the air thinning, there's less oxygen available for combustion, which can hinder engine performance. Secondly, we have the wings, the real heroes of flight. They generate lift by creating a pressure difference between the top and bottom surfaces. However, as the air thins, there are fewer molecules to create this pressure difference, thus reducing the lift produced. This doesn't mean we can't fly high, oh no. It just means that aircraft need to be specifically engineered and operated to deal with these challenges. So, the higher we go, the harder the engines have to work and the more carefully the aircraft must be designed and operated. It's not just the aircraft that face challenges at high altitudes, the human body does too. At high altitudes the air is thinner, which means there are fewer oxygen molecules for us to breathe in. This can lead to hypoxia, a condition where the body or a region of the body is deprived of adequate oxygen supply. Symptoms can range from shortness of breath and increased heart rate to confusion and even loss of consciousness. Pilots are trained to recognize these signs and have access to supplemental oxygen to mitigate the effects. Another issue is dehydration. The low humidity in the aircraft cabin can cause skin to dry out and can lead to thirst, dry mouth and fatigue. This is why hydration is so important during flights, especially long ones. But it's not all doom and gloom. With the right preparation and attention to these physiological factors, pilots and passengers can safely and comfortably conquer the skies. As we can see, high altitude flight requires not only technical, but also physiological preparation and understanding. High above the ground, the weather plays by its own rules. This is a world where the air is thin, the temperature plunges and the winds whip at incredible speeds. Here, pilots grapple with unique weather patterns unseen on the Earth's surface. One such phenomenon is the jet stream, a high-speed meandering air current that circles the globe. These fast-moving winds can either propel an aircraft forward reducing flight time and fuel consumption or impede its path, extending the journey. Then there's turbulence, an aviation term for sudden, unpredictable and often violent changes in wind speed or direction. Turbulence at high altitudes is primarily caused by atmospheric pressure, jet streams, weather fronts and thunderstorms. These weather patterns, though challenging, are not insurmountable. Pilots employ advanced technology and their own expertise to navigate these high altitude hurdles, ensuring a safe and smooth journey for all on board. In the realm of high altitudes, weather is a formidable player that pilots must reckon with. Plotting the course for a long range flight is a task of precision and expertise. It's a grand game of chess with the earth as the board and aircraft as the pieces. The complexities of long range navigation are numerous and multifaceted. Pilots rely heavily on advanced satellite systems, which provide real-time data on location, altitude and speed. But even with these modern marvels, challenges persist. 
Consider polar routes, for instance. These paths, which pass over the Earth's poles, offer the shortest distances between many international destinations, but they also present unique difficulties. The Earth's magnetic fields can distort compass readings, making navigation tricky. Extreme cold can affect aircraft performance and even freeze fuel. Satellite signals can be weaker or non-existent. These challenges demand meticulous planning, expert knowledge, and sometimes quick thinking. It's a testament to the skill of pilots and the power of technology that we can traverse these routes safely and efficiently. Navigating the globe is a complex dance of technology and human skill. Fuel, the lifeblood of any long-range flight. It's not simply about filling up the tanks and taking off. In the realm of high-altitude, long-haul aviation, fuel management becomes a complex, critical operation. It's a dance of calculation and anticipation, choreographed by pilots and flight planners alike. Consider the journey as a whole. From the moment the aircraft leaves the runway, every mile flown, every altitude climbed or descended, and every weather pattern encountered affects fuel consumption. It's a careful balancing act where the aim is to optimize the fuel burn rate while ensuring there's enough reserve to tackle any unforeseen circumstances. Flight planners must account for numerous variables. Aircraft weight, wind speeds, temperature, and even the type of fuel used. They employ sophisticated software to crunch these numbers, but at the end of the day, it's the pilots who make real-time decisions based on their expertise and judgment. Managing fuel in the skies is a high-stakes game of numbers and judgment. To withstand the challenges of high altitude, aircraft are feats of design and engineering. The very fabric of these machines is woven with innovation and expertise. Let's take a closer look. Materials used in aircraft construction are meticulously chosen for their strength, lightness, and resistance to harsh conditions. Aluminum, for example, is often used due to its excellent strength-to-weight ratio. But it's not just about the materials. The architecture of an aircraft is a masterclass in engineering. Wing design, for instance, plays a crucial role in maintaining lift at high altitudes where the air is thinner, the wings are shaped and angled to maximize lift and minimize drag. The engines, too, are designed to function efficiently in less dense air, with turbofan engines being a popular choice for their ability to compress incoming air for combustion. The aircraft's pressurization system is another testament to ingenious design, maintaining a comfortable and safe environment inside the cabin, even at cruising altitudes of 35,000 feet. The aircraft we fly in are marvels of human ingenuity, designed to overcome the challenges we've discussed. In the event of an emergency at high altitude, every second counts. The unique environment of high-altitude flight presents specific emergency scenarios. One of the most dramatic of these is rapid decompression, where a sudden loss of cabin pressure can have serious consequences. In such cases, oxygen masks drop down providing vital life support as pilots descend to a safer altitude. But there's more to high-altitude emergencies than just decompression. Engine failures, severe turbulence, and even onboard fires can become exponentially more dangerous at extreme heights. This is why aircraft are equipped with comprehensive safety systems. For instance, fire suppression systems use halon gas to extinguish flames without depleting oxygen. Moreover, pilots undergo rigorous training to handle these emergencies, practicing in simulators that mimic high-altitude conditions. They learn to respond quickly and efficiently, prioritizing the safety of all on board. Being prepared for emergencies at high altitude is a critical aspect of aviation safety. Technology is a game-changer in the world of high-altitude, long-range flight. Today's aircraft are equipped with cutting-edge innovations that make high-altitude travel safer and more efficient. One such innovation is advanced pressurization systems. These marvels of engineering mimic sea-level conditions inside the cabin, even when the plane is cruising at altitudes where the outside air pressure is considerably lower. 
This helps to mitigate the physiological effects of high altitudes on pilots and passengers. Next, let's talk about advanced avionics, the electronic systems used on aircraft. These systems have evolved tremendously, with modern planes now boasting digital touchscreen displays, synthetic vision systems for better situational awareness, and predictive flight management systems that help pilots plan for fuel efficiency and weather avoidance. In essence, these technological advances are transforming the aviation industry. They've made it possible to fly higher, faster and further while improving safety and comfort. As technology advances, so does our ability to conquer the challenges of high altitude flight. As we've seen, flying at high altitudes over long distances presents a unique set of challenges. The thin air up there can influence engine performance and lift while also having physiological effects on both pilots and passengers. Weather patterns become more complex, navigation becomes more intricate, and fuel management is absolutely critical. Yet, despite these challenges, we've seen how aircraft design, materials, and technology have evolved to meet them head-on. From advanced pressurization systems to improved avionics, innovation continues to push the boundaries of what's possible in high altitude and long-range flight. Looking ahead, the future of aviation is bright, filled with promise and potential. As we continue to learn, innovate, and adapt, we'll unlock new possibilities and solutions. The challenges will remain, but so will our determination to overcome them. The sky is not the limit, but a frontier for human innovation and perseverance. Let's continue to soar higher, safer, and smarter.